there and welcome to Deborah's directory for the dead. Are you here for the seance this afternoon? That is so weird because you sounded so ugly on the phone. <laughs> I've gone red. I feel like I've gone red. Have I gone red? Do you want some red? I mean, I can get you. You know, I'm actually really happy that you came in today because for weeks now, I've not had a single client ever since people started calling it desperate Deborah's and I'm like, <laughs> I'm not desperate, do you know what I mean? I would never be desperate. Do you think I'm desperate? Because I'm definitely not desperate. Yeah, okay, so who are we contacting today? Grandma Audrey got you. So, I mean, I know it's not, it's not a date, but if this was a date, it would be like, meet the grandparent. She's telling me to tell you that you need to be more aware of what's in front of you in life. Yeah, the full picture. Is there a job right in front of you that you're not taking? Is there a car about to just ram you over? Or are you sitting directly across from someone who could be a potential wife? It's not as if I don't want kids, do you know what I mean? I'd love to have children. I just need to find the right person to have them with. Mm-hmm. Mm. Do you have kids? You see that ring that you've got on your pinky? Put it on my finger. Just to see what it would look like. God, look how much that suits me. Doesn't that just feel right? Your grandma was a really big part of your childhood and you really want to... Yeah, no, no, I get that. Um, this might be a bad time to ask, but have you ever played spin the bottle? This was her ring. It's so big on me. She must have had like little sausage fingers. <laughs> I mean, I don't need a partner to complete me. Do you know what I mean? I don't need, I don't need one. <laughs> I really, I don't need one. Yeah, you're right. I should be working. Uh -huh. Put your hands over mine. Oh my goodness, they're really soft. <laughs> okay, okay, back to your grandma. The third wheel. She is a cheeky, cheeky girl. She's telling us to kiss. And so what if I'm not married yet? You know, I mean, when the time comes around, I'll have the whole thing planned out anyway. I've got the dress picked. I've actually got the dress bought. If you want, I could go and change into the dress and show you what it looks. You don't want to see that. Oh yeah, no, you're right. Sorry, I should give you that back. Here. So if we do get through, um, what would you like to say to your, to your grandma? That you love her? Yeah. Do you not want to say anything else? Like, if you're seeing anyone just now, or you're seeing someone already. All right, no, that's, that's good for you. Dump them. Oh, oh. I swear I was possessed. I, right there I was possessed. Right there in front of you, pos possession was what happened there. You don't think this is working out. I don't think this is working out, okay? All you've done is sit and ask about your grandma and me trying to get in contact with her. You've not even asked me how I am, like how I feel about it. Um, I just, Crying again. Although I will have to charge you an extra 40 pounds because we did go over time. 